it's Diana Willard. How are you today? Today we're making a delicious rump roast with vegetables in my wonderful Power Pressure Cooker XL. Now here's the rump roast. I put salt and pepper in, uh, on it, olive oil in the pan, and we're just uh, searing it a little bit to get a little brown. Also, take two cloves of garlic, mash them up, and we're putting that in there too for flavor. The meat here. It's 2.97 pounds for this rump roast. I'm putting it on meat for one hour. It's clowning down a little bit because it's getting hot and we're searing the meat first. So it started with one hour. I want it a little uh, longer than the last time. We want it to cook very well. All right, now here I have. Uh, one tablespoon of soy sauce, one tablespoon of steak sauce, one tablespoon of, um, of apple cider vinegar, and uh, one tablespoon of Worcestershire sauce. Throw it in here. Give it a good flavor. Okay. Then quarter of a cup of tomato paste. All for flavor. Like that. Like that. And okay, here is third of a cup of dry red wine. Pour that in here. Now what we need here is we need liquid. So I'm using the organic Emerald's beef stock. Take the whole carton of it here. How much is this? 32 ounces. Pour it in here. Make a good gravy. The whole thing in there. The um, this is a little bit of a packet of seasoning for a pot roast. You put some water in here and you pour that in there. See all the seasoning that's coming out? Now, the one I used here was um, I don't even know if I have it here anymore. Um, it was Big Y seasoning, so I just kept it. And uh, I don't really have it here. I threw the bag out or something anyway. It's, um, it just comes with a bag that I don't want. So it's just a big white seasoning for pot roast. And I mix it with some water and that's that. Now we're going to take all the vegetables, carrots, potatoes, onions, and celery. And put that in there. And I'll give you all the um, instructions um, at the bottom of the video. And one more thing. I think I got everything right now. And I want to put a tiny little bit of butter in there. Just about a quarter of a cup here of butter. It's going to make a good sauce. All right, now let me close it. Make sure you line it up here that it's closed. And the button has to go over here by the arrow for steam pressure. All right, so in another 50 minutes, I'll be back and uh, I'm going to show you the end product. So I'll see you in a little while now. Bye-bye.